Florida has announced a multi-million dollar investment to make riding the bus a lot more convenient and the plans come through a partnership between the county and Marta. Now we've learned that rider complaints played a really strong part in some of the improvement plans. CBS 46's Haley Mason is advocating for Marta customers and she's live in DeKalb County with a look at some of these upcoming changes. Haley. Having a bus shelter like this can be a bit of a hot commodity, especially on a rainy day if you're having to wait for the bus. Well, DeKalb County officials are trying to make them more common and more accessible and less of a lucky find. On a wet and downright messy day like this one, the last place many people want to be is standing in the rain waiting on the bus. We need more shelters out here for weather like this, you know what I mean, to keep people out the rain. Marta says it's heard complaints like these and has partnered with DeKalb County to usher in major improvements for riders. It's making a multi-million dollar investment, pouring in up to $1.5 million a year over the next five years in DeKalb. They need it especially in DeKalb County. And the work has already started. This year, MARTA added 20 new bus shelters across the county. Next year, it will be installing up to 70 new bus shelters and benches each year for the next five years, totaling more than 350. Most of the plans will be focused across South DeKalb County. South DeKalb has complained about the lack of bathroom access, the lack of bus shelters, the lack of benches, having to stand out in days like this in the rain without a shelter. And bathrooms at high volume stations will be open later until 10 p.m. The bathroom situation is definitely needed because most of the bathrooms that are on Marta, they don't, you, you can't use them, they have access to the public. So they will be cleaner and they'll be more accessible. Marta says it will add more than 120 new bus buses to its fleet, hoping to make ridership more reliable. When the rubber hits the road, that's what riders care about most. Coming up at 6 o'clock, we explain how MARTA plans to fund and keep up these new improvements over the next coming years. Reporting live in South DeKalb County, Haley Mason, CBS 46 News.